Quick tip on the volley. Are you the type of player that likes to be aggressive and move forward and get to the net? That's a good thing because that's where you're going to put points on the board. Or are you a doubles player? You're at the net a lot. However, if you find yourself dumping volleys in the net, I think this next tip is really going to help you because every time I see my students make a mistake, they have one thing in common. And it's this. When you're at the net and you've got that racket out in front of you, if you don't if you bring the racket back without turning the shoulders, turning, you've got to turn sideways slightly. If you don't have time, you have to compensate by opening the face of the racket. Because here's what happens when you don't turn sideways for volleys. Now you gotta try and get sideways. Sometimes you don't have time. But like I say, if you don't have time, you have to open the face because when you do not turn, if you go like this, you're, the best thing that's going to happen is you're trying to push the ball and the racket, see the racket head can only go so far. My arm is fully extended now and what happens? The racket starts to go like this. It naturally comes down when you're facing the net. When I turn sideways by keeping my left hand on the throat of the racket, now, even if I can't get a good step in, even if I only get a little step, I can stay sideways and I can punch through the shot. I can think of just letting the racket go out towards my target instead of down. So that's my tip, quick tip for today. Get sideways as much as you can. If you don't have time, open the face and you're going to see a lot more volleys are going to be clearing the net. Okay, take a look in slow motion. I'm just setting the racket to meet the ball, stepping in, boom, at contact. Notice the shoulders are perpendicular to the net. And that allows me to hit through the shot out towards my target. See the racket's going out towards the target. Okay, here's what happens when you don't turn the shoulders. The shoulders right now are parallel with the net. The arm can only go so far it's like you're trying to push the ball over the net and the racket goes down. Okay, the shoulders here turn, but watch what happens when I make contact with the ball. See, the shoulders are opening up too soon. Now watch, this ball hits the net and notice my shoulders right now are parallel with the net. When you hit a ball in the net, I guarantee your shoulders are parallel with the net, not perpendicular. Okay, take a look in slow motion. Turning the shoulders, setting the racket for the oncoming ball. That's all I'm doing right there, but the shoulders have turned. Now, as I go forward, I take a little step and at contact, notice the shoulders are not parallel with the net, sideways. That allows me to let my racket, see here, my racket has, is driving out towards the target and does not have a tendency to go down. The other thing I wanted to mention, I'm still having my French Open Super Sale. The link to my website, website is in the description box. You can get all of my coaching, 45 years of experience, over 45, for $97. It's a great deal. 
I hope you enjoyed that video. Get sideways, less volleys in the net. Please subscribe, give me a like, give me a thumbs up. Post any questions or comments, I always do my best to get back to you as quick as possible. I'm here for you to improve your tennis, to have more tennis success.